In this short video, I'm going to be showing you how to use ChatGPT in Dutch. Now, whether you want the text to appear in Dutch uh, when you're on ChatGPT, or whether you want ChatGPT to message you back in the Dutch language, in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to do that because it's totally possible. Now, with that said, I do want to mention one thing. You can't really change the language of ChatGPT because there is no settings option, which means that it is currently only officially available in English. However, there is a little way around that. So, I am on Google Chrome on Windows PC. So, to give yourself the best chance for this to work, make sure that you are at least using Google Chrome because I'm not sure whether any of the other browsers have this feature available. With that said, once you're on ChatGPT, simply right-click anywhere on the screen, then go down to Translate to, and now as you can see, mine is already uh, set to uh, Dutch here because I tested this to see if it works, and it does. So, once I click this, it's going to translate the entire page to the Dutch language, as you can see. The entire page is translated. Now, to add the Dutch language, simply click on the three dots up here, then click on choose another language, then on the little arrow, and then simply find Dutch from this massive list of languages right here. Click on Dutch, then click on Done, or Translate if this is the first time adding the language, and it will automatically translate this page for you. Now, when it comes to getting your output from ChatGPT in the Dutch language, you don't need to change any settings because um, it is basically going to detect the language that you're using and it will just uh, spit back the answer in the same language. So, in this case, Dutch. I did go ahead and copy a little phrase from Google Translate uh, in the Dutch language just to test this out and show you what ChatGPT comes back with. So, what I copied and pasted was, how are you? in Dutch and let's see what it comes back with. Now, as you can see, it's giving me a little error. If that happens to you, uh, simply refresh the page and try again. And within seconds, uh, it is already coming back to me with a response in the Dutch language. And that's pretty much it. Hopefully you found this video helpful. If you did, please do go ahead and leave a like down below and subscribe to the channel. If you have any questions, let me know and I'll be more than happy to help.